Majority of you would like to start working online and earning money, but you don't believe you have the right skills to do the jobs. Lucky for you, today I'm going to share with you six jobs that do not require any skills for you to get hired and make money. This is your lucky day. You can do these six jobs from anywhere, even the comfort of your home, and you can get your money wired right into your account. Some of these jobs can be done across multiple websites. Today I'll be using people per hour to show you a review of these jobs that you can easily get with zero skills. My name is Vince and this is Actionable User whereby we help you become more actionable when using people per hour without taking up much of your time and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Yeah, so now I'm in people per hour and I want to show you the jobs that I'm talking about. The first one we look at proofreading and editing. So I'll come to the search category and I'll find this search box. If you can't see it, just come here to this drop down, click on it, then come to search projects. Yeah, I'll begin by searching proofreading. These are the results. So we can start scrolling down and looking at some jobs. This is proofreading and formatting design. Click and open it to find out more. Yeah, maybe you can send our proposal or we can read all this description whereby you can find out more information about this. If you're given a project like proofreading and formatting, you can use free tools like Grammarly, which can help you do the work and get it done without leaving any grammatical errors. I've created a video which you can find linked in the description below and actually this is a snippet of it. As you progress, you can come here to this menu. After opening the menu, I can scroll down and there is the language preference whereby if I have on it I can choose the language that you want whether American or now you can change here and select another one and it will guide you from there. That is how you can simply proofread your documents using Grammarly. We'll move forward to the second item which is online research. Now I'll come here and type in online research and find jobs about doing online research yeah then this is what comes up someone is needed to scrap the web for abandoned blogs and you can see this is a featured opportunity 17 hours ago so they're paying a very hefty price for someone to just scrap the web for abandoned blogs so this is something that you can come to your preferred search engine and type in whatever you want let's say you're doing research about the first world war you can just type in that and search. We have Wikipedia, we have other tools that you can use to read and do some research about let's say the first world war. Alternatively you can use other features like ChatGPT and AI to help you do your research before you can now give let's say bullet points or a small summary. Now here we also have market research whereby someone needs you to let's say do research about a given topic. You can say the sales of electronics via social media that can be a very very good topic yeah so now let's move on to the next item which is item number three that is translation before we do that you need to understand that translation jobs will work if let's say you understand more than one language let me put it in inside here and we can see the translation jobs yeah there are a couple of translation jobs found i need an article translated to spanish so if you understand spanish you can apply and get this $35 per hour and if you understand some Scottish languages you can help translate for this medical hospital also there are other Spanish translation jobs here also Indian translation work so there are basically many jobs you can see also Italian here whichever language you can scroll and find a language that you are conversant in and you can translate that so you can easily earn money by doing that yeah so we will move on to item number four which is background removal so I'll come here and write photo background removal you can see we have 151 projects we have a project entailing removal of people or items from the background of one photo that is eight dollars to remove the background of people or items from photos you don't need to be an expert I have a video whereby I show how to remove the backgrounds from photos 
using simple tools like Microsoft PowerPoint. Majority of you actually do not know that Microsoft PowerPoint can remove photo backgrounds for free. Most of you have been using paid or free websites which allow you to do that. The problem with these websites is that most of them they are not 100% free whereby there is a limitation to the number of photos you can remove backgrounds or there is some limitation in the quality of photo you can download so they actually compress and intentionally destroy your photos so that you can pay to get the better service so let me quickly go into powerpoint and show you how you can do that right in the picture format we have various groups over here one of them is this one adjust over here whereby you can see in the far left there is the remove background and other options so i'll click on remove background it opens its very own background removal tab which has some options the software has gone ahead and tried to predict remove background it opens its very own background removal tab which has some options the software has gone ahead and tried to predict what parts of the image I want to keep and what I want to remove it's not accurate I need to use this formatting options over here I can start with mark areas to keep so I'll come and just draw a line and it has detected I want to keep this area then I want to remove this area so I'll go here mark areas to remove and I'll draw a simple line just like that and it has detected that and I actually need to save these changes here you can see a keep changes and a discard changes option click on keep changes my changes are kept I want to take you to the next item which is formatting word documents as you've seen the drill I'll just come here and type and I'll go ahead and search there a couple found so I can scroll down here we have formatting a report now if you understand how to format these big documents let's say doing things like inserting things like table of contents and all that you can do that since Microsoft Word is a software that most people have and most people have been using we also have someone needed to help with the layout of a document now let me quickly go to Microsoft Word and I'll show you how you can easily do this so you actually need to insert a table of contents of which most people don't know how to do exactly that or it may be a hectic task let's say you may not know where to find the table of contents where to actually insert that of which it's kind of a task and a long chore so if you understand this you can come and insert all this and insert it through the document and do other formatting like headers and footers and other things also you can do things like inserting list of tables and list of figures of which many people don't know but if you know how to do that you can help someone out and you can earn good money from people per hour now remember that you can also do things like inserting tables of which majority of people don't know how to insert tables so most people actually they know the ordinary kind of tables of which inserting these tables some people may actually want to hire you to make their work easier so you can help someone insert these types of tables and do other forms of formatting like inserting hyperlinks and other stuff using microsoft word so you can earn good money by doing that now i want to move on to the next item which is item number six that is data entry so I'll come here to the search engine then I'll search data entry what you need to know about data entry is something simple like basically taking forms tabulating that information and keying in all that information inside Microsoft Excel of which I shall show you in a short period of time yeah a data entry analyst for a growing company so this small company can actually hire you to do the data entry work also there is medical data entry for 7000 forms now let me jump into microsoft excel and show you exactly what i'm talking about and what you can see here this data was gathered by handing out forms this is the feedback all these respondents give we can see that this column i'm on which was the second question is gender 
can see this other column is for this other question how frequently do you buy from online retailers it was a study about online retail now this could take a lot of time to enter all these rows and columns and all these sentences inside here yeah you can earn by doing simple tasks like this one where you can just come and create a table start keying in data the first respondent just right here gender male the level of education all that and all this other information as you move ahead then you can forward it to the person who has hired you and you can earn your money yeah you need to remember that in people per hour you can find all sorts of jobs let's say technology and programming this is computing all these jobs you can go through them and find one that fits your skills and remember that others actually don't need skills since it's things that you've already been doing on a day-to-day -day basis of which they are all here you can search through them at your own free time and you'll find something which fits you there we go beautiful people that is how you can easily make money from online jobs without having any skill if you think I missed something remind me in the comment section below if you have a specific question, leave it in the comments and I'll try my best to answer it. Also remember that I've created other people per hour videos which you can see linked in the description box below. Make sure to subscribe, leave a like and share this video with your friends. And guys, I'll see you on the next video. Bye.